Unbeaten McAdory will host Spanish Fort in the game of the week. The Toros have a 12-game playoff win streak. Well, the main thing is that we're here. Um, our guys have worked hard. Uh, we got a chance. We're here now. We just expect to go out and play our very best football uh, game of the year. Uh, Spanish Fort, of course, with their great tradition, back-to-back -back titles. Uh, it's going to be a uh, tough challenge, but I think our guys are ready to, to, to give a good fight. Can you describe this team for me? I mean, I write a lot about a lot of teams, and whenever I write about you guys, I find myself thinking, well, they're not winning impressively. But do you guys care about stuff like that? I mean, is it just move on? I don't. I really don't. It's, a win is a win. I, I'm just happy to be in third round. A lot of teams wish they were. And we just beat beat teams the way we beat them. Came in and just had more points than the other team at the end of the fourth quarter. I mean, you're watching. I think McAdory is 12-0. and 0. Spanish Fort is 11-1. and 1. Not too bad for a couple of teams that rose up from Class 5A. What kind of effort will it take to, to beat Spanish Fort this week? 100% effort. Uh, this is a team that we've played two times and we haven't beat them. So it's really just who's going to come out on top. Uh, our effort has to be better than any game, any, better than a Bestman game. And Bestman game was a game that we were looking forward to. So it's going to be half the way worse than Bestman. What type of game do you see on Friday night? Physical, four quarter, down see, in the minute? Because that's where those have been. That's yes, where your games have so been. I, yeah, I see a physical four, four, four quarter game. What do you think the strength of this team would be? What have you noticed? Is it the same thing week to week, or is it a different element? I think overall, you know, we have some uh, – our quarterback, uh, Jordan Jones, you know, he has uh, definitely big play potential where if he gets out in space, you know, he can – he can take it all the way, and Shaq Terry's been a great uh, running back for us. He broke his collarbone week three and missed five weeks in the middle of the season. Um, we got good receivers. Our offensive line has done an outstanding job on defense. We play extremely hard. Uh, good tacklers, uh, good quickness. So uh, the, the strength of the team is just we're pretty solid at every position. How good is Jordan? How good has JJ and Shaquille been on the other side of the ball? Where you know it's a team game, and maybe you guys hadn't stopped the other guys as much as you should, but your guys are alive because they've scored with the other guys. Yes, they've been great. I mean, what they what they produce on offense is just wonderful. As as they running down the field, man, that's that what helps us. As long as they keep the ball moving, and then they keep on scoring and keep us keep defense in it. If we if we mess up, you know, and they they score on score on us, then they come right back out and, and attack them. So you know it's. Thank you.